So today I'm going to explain the different grips of the drumstick and um, why and what sort of genre of music you should do them in. Or not should, but whatever it makes you feel comfortable. Um, there is a philosophy that um, incorrect gripping of a stick will kind of either lengthen or shorten your drumming career. Um, just because there's so much muscle and forearm involved depending on how you play and how hard you, you hit. Um, first, I will... There are different ranges of, of, of sticks, but traditionally these marching sticks were often played in a very mar marching style. There are, there are a lot of stories on where it originated from and why, but a lot of it was because of the sling coming over the back and only being able to do and play in this fashion. Um, there wasn't a lot of movement. But basically, the stick is, is played with the hand under it and just sliding in between the, mid, the middle finger and your ring finger with your thumb on top and the stick going through with, it's choked up just a little bit so that you have more control. Um, the farther back you are uh, makes it a lot more difficult to keep control of it, something that long. Um, but normally you want to get a good, good three or four inches from the end of the base of the stick and you would basically attack the snare either at an angle like this, which a lot of jazz players play at, or they come down and they, they literally use the four to five inches of the end of the stick to hit from the center to, 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 the, to the edge of the ring, and um, which gives a lot more volume. Now, the other way to, to grip, and often the jazz grip is played with much smaller sticks and regular drumsticks, not just mark like marching sticks. Uh, the non-traditional grip is basically both hands grabbing the stick in the same way. Um, I like to grab them just a little choked up by about an inch or two up from the base and it's basically your thumbs over the top and you, which gives for, for me a lot more control. Um, your arm is at a 90 degree angle with the actual snare drum and um, giving you a lot of um, room and comfortability as you, as you play. Um, it does offer a little bit more control based on how you were trained um, to play uh, drums or the, or the snare. A lot of times if you're coming from a marching background or a jazz background, you'll do a lot of sticking with uh, the actual tra traditional grip and they often have you switch for either style, flash, or control. And um, some drummers play a little farther back, like I said, or they'll play choked up, and which just gives them a lot more comfortability. Now what happens is that depending on how comfortable you are and what style you're playing, you will fold your, heart, fold your wrists on the inside or fold them out. Either way is whatever is more comfortable for you. Just know that there are consequences to either one. That's it. If you'd like to learn more about playing drums, please click on any of the videos that you see here.